Chris Christopherson played a song during Willie Nelson's 90th birthday party celebration, and at the end, you could hear sobbing. If this was the iconic songwriter's last bow, my God, was it special. It's Billy Dukes, and I do want to be clear that we're not inferring anything about Chris Christopherson's current health. In a moment, I'll share what's known about the man behind songs like Me and Bobby McGee, Sunday Morning Coming Down, and Help me make it through tonight. Chris was one of the four original Highwaymen, and along with Willie Nelson, he's one of two remaining, so it was fitting that he was there to say happy birthday to his friend during a two-day all-star concert in California in late April. Do you have a favorite memory of Chris? Comment below and consider tapping subscribe for more coverage of the legends done right. Credit Roseanne Cash for bringing Christopherson to the stage. The crowd loved it. Together they sang Loving Her Was Easier, a song Chris wrote that was recorded by Roger Miller, Tom Paul and the Glazer Brothers, Waylon Jennings, and Roseanne herself. I want to pause here and point out a few things. The first is Jamie Johnson is casually playing guitar for the house band at this show, no big deal. The second is that the performance was one of a couple of a dozen A-list performances. Miranda Lambert, Chris Stapleton, Dwight Yoakam, Snoop Dogg, Tom Jones, Jack Johnson, and even George Strait came out to celebrate with Willie. Tell how Poncho fell and left his living in a cheap hotel. Finally, I want to share some still shots from video taken by Dan Schramm. I linked to his video of the performance in the description section below, but you can tell that Chris is really dialed into the moment and he's clearly having the time of his life. Thumbs up this video if you're happy to hear that. At age 86, he's officially retired, but makes the occasional appearance, like when he helped induct Hank Williams Jr. into the Country Music Hall of Fame in October 2021. In the mid-2000s, Chris was diagnosed with Alzheimer's, but 11 years later, it was revealed that he had been misdiagnosed and really had symptoms caused by Lyme disease. OK Magazine shares a quote from Chris that indicates he's living happily in Hawaii, spending his spare time on his tractor, but he's 86 and everyone at the Hollywood Bowl was aware his best and most rowdy performances were behind him. Roseanne Cash especially off the stage. Chris smiled and recognized the crowd with a salute and a fist to the heart and then a thumbs up. Gosh, if that was his final moment on stage, what a gift. Night one closed with an all call of Willis Circle Be Unbroken, and Chris was right back out there. Night two finished with happy birthday, and yeah, Chris was there for that too. Happy birthday, Willie, and thank you for sharing your day with so many country legends like Chris Christopherson. I'm Billy Dukes for Taste of Country. Thanks for watching, and thanks for subscribing.